What's going on guys, I'm back with hopefully my final Advanced Warfare video and today's video, this is going to be episode I think 3 or 4 I think 4 actually of reasons why I still hate Advanced Warfare yep, even more reasons, I don't know how many reasons I've already g gave you I think I've given you like 20 with all the other videos that I've done but I just hate this game so much. I want it to just go die. I never want I never want this game to come out again. I just hope Brock Lesnar comes in and just suplex city takes this game to suplex city and I just hate it. I just hate this game so much. I cannot wait for Black Ops 3 as I'm recording this four days away. And I just want to get advanced warfare finished and done with and then as soon as Black Ops 3 is out it's off me Xbox never to play again and let's get down to hopefully I can finish off the rest of the reasons why it sucks right so going back to Exo Zombies the fucking Goliath Zombies oh my god I saw them in the freaking infection poster and I thought you know what these they m must have something bad about them if they, they can't make them too overpowered spawns in it has EMP missiles. Eh, still. Maybe it doesn't do a lot of damage. And I thought, of course it's going to do a lot of damage. Or maybe it's just slow. No, no. It, it runs the same speed as the rest of the zombies. But it has a Goliath suit. Yeah. But Sledgehammer would just like to piss all over you. Well, maybe, maybe he's not got that much health then. No, 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 no. He has, he has pretty much. The way on how I feel about it, he probably has more than George Romero. Or maybe, maybe he can only, maybe he doesn't melee you. Of course he does. Of course he does. Yep. The fucking Goliath zombie, so fucking annoying. And that's one of the reasons why it's in the worst zombies map ever. Yes. If you guys say Transit was the worst zombies map ever, I just hope you guys have played Exo Zombies because Infection, Infection makes Transit look like Kino. That's what I. That's what I hate it that much. I'd rather play Transit for the rest of my life than play Infection one more time. And yeah, I just hate Exo Zombies in a full. Next up is the magnitude was too overpowered. Now, of course, I'm talking about the ASM-1 magnitude. It is so fucking overpowered. All you have to do with it is get 300 kills with the ASM-1, which is the easiest gun to get kills with. Pretty much, if you can't get kills with an ASM-1, you cannot play the game. It's not that the game, it's not that the game is laggy or anything. You just can't play the game. The ASM-1 is probably the most overpowered gun in the game. And if you can't get kills with them, you're just bad. And the magnitude. This this belongs more like as a professional. Rather than a freaking... Rather than a permanent. This one... So there's guns like the Atlas 45. Which most of them put so their handling. So that the Atlas 45 doesn't even need... Yeah, you have the ASM-1, which was, oh no man, let's put two range on it, one less handling, one less mobility. Why not two less damage? Because, fuck you, that's why. And next up is going to be competitive game modes. I hated the competitive game modes. And mainly, momentum and hardpoint were ruined. Now, momentum, everyone knows, was war from Call of Duty World at War. But how I remember it, World of War, is when um, when you when you're pushing back to the final flag, you know, the final flag when you're about to about to win, the enemy always spawns near the flag. That's how I remembered it. I don't know if it was different for you guys, but I you know, I haven't played World of War in ages. But I remember it when you get to the final flag and the enemy always spawns at the flag just to make it difficult. But no. You get to enemy gets your flag. You they wipe if they wipe out your entire team at the flag. Tough shit. You're spawning over 
at they were where they were supposed to spawn. What the fuck? That is fucking stupid. And hard point, hard point has literally became pointless. It used to be good in Black Ops 2, but Advanced Warfare has just made it terrible. And also, speaking of terrible, terrible game modes. Shitty capture the flag room back. When Call of Duty Ghost brings in Blitz, an amazing game mode. I loved it so much, yet they bring back capture the flag. Are you fucking serious? And don't even get me fucking started on Uplink. I will... Uplink is so... The armor on the flat on the freaking satellite makes me feel like everyone, the enemy, whatever they have the satellite, they're a fucking juggernaut. When I'm at the frick, when I've got the freaking satellite, uh, just, just like, just get two bullets, two bullets. That's all you get. And I just, these game modes were so bad. Fortunately, Domination was still in there. I think if they didn't put Domination in, this would definitely be the worst card ever, even though it is. And it still is. And the the competitive was bad. Search and Destroy is just the same as, as, as it was before, so I can't really comment on that. It's stupid, but it's, in every game it's stupid. And the Dull Gun game mode, the next one. This ain't part of competitive game mode, obviously, but... Gun game in Black Ops 1, I enjoyed. Black Ops 2, enjoyed it even more. Like, I was playing on, my P on a PS3 a couple of weeks ago when um, one of my friends brought his PS3 around because he was watching Hell in a Cell. And this was, well, this was like last week, actually. And he, and I, one, of the enemies, one of the enemies was already on the SMR when I joined in. And I felt like I'd just go around stabbing, so I stabbed for like three kills, but then I got bored of it, and then I started trying to win. One. He was on an SMR. I didn't even stab the first place guy. The people who I stabbed were on like a KSG, an M1216, and I think a... Um, the last submachine gun, I think, is the Shikam, right? Yeah. The last, last submachine gun before you get the assault rifles, yeah. And I still won, and that's why it's so great. Ghosts, Ghosts, I'm going to agree, wasn't really any better with gun game, but still. Weren't as bad as Advanced Warfare. Why the fuck did they put variants in it? I do not know. And that leads, that variance leads to the next one, which is stupid legendaries. I've just seen what, the only good legendary, in my opinion, is even a blunderbuss. Or the STG, so that's probably two actually. But I've seen like the SVO putting up handling and putting up handling and mobility for some good. I don't know what it is. I think it's accuracy. I'll have to check. I'll have to check with the SVO one. And um, the MP41, an integrated laser sight, and putting up handling and mobility for I think range I think. Why would you do that? If it's gonna be a legendary it should be it should be like two plus damage for one for one less fire rate and one less accuracy handling or mobility. But no, they just decided to put shitty legendary stuff putting up fucking handling which no one cares about. And this is this game was just not thought of correctly. And the final, thank god I managed to finish it in this video, but the final reason why I hate Advanced Warfare is where are the fucking supply credits? Ages ago, we were teased at something called supply credits, which were a way on how Grandmaster Prestige people would be able to get advanced supply drops. And I've talked about this before, and I was really excited about this and I was actually, this was actually getting me to consider possibly buying the next game in three years. Because if they bring it out, supply drops back in Advanced Warfare 2, they would have to bring this back in. And I thought, this might be pretty good, I'll be able to get supply drops after Grandmaster. When was that teased? That was teased like, I think, five months ago. 
and I don't think there's any coincidence that they've actually they've actually teased it and then they've just not gone with it. They it's obvious that they've looked at their their fit their like computers and they thought, you know what, we're probably gonna lose money. No you won't. No one is buying your supply drops. They're so shit, no one buys them. I'm not buying them. You've not once made cheaper. What have you done? Bonus advanced supply drops. Wow, two more or four more supply drops. Wow, you must be saving as the bargains right there. I've just this like the supply credits was probably like the only thing that was gonna actually tell me like you know what maybe advanced warfare 2 might not be too bad but no sledgehammer and activision they've obviously just got back back on their little computers and now they're just thinking that they're just they think they're gonna lose money but in reality they've just lost an advanced warfare 2 customer i'm sorry sledgehammer i'm but for the one whole year we've given up treyarch for this Treyarch, the kings of card. Treyarch, the greatest people on the planet. We give it up one game just so you can have a try. And you failed. You have failed and your games are fucking laggy as and I will not be buying Advanced Warfare 2. Believe that. And sorry about sorry about me getting my anger out. That was just a finish up my anger, taking out my anger out on this game. I've hated it so much. But if you could like and subscribe today, if you guys hate Advanced Warfare, if you guys love Advanced Warfare, I would suggest you go and see a doctor and also I don't know why you just want to watch this video. And also, who else is super hyped for Black Ops 3? I am... Um, I'm... I'm not super hyped for Advanced Warfare 2. If I do buy it, I'm probably just going to use it as toilet paper. It would hurt. It would probably hurt my ass, but who cares? Advanced Warfare. Talk. Well, actually, no. Talk about wiping your ass with shit. Anyway, still, I'm sorry about taking my anger out in this video, and hopefully, I don't have to do another one of these. And goodbye.